The Lord explains the day of slaughter and deliverance, and the city called martyrdom. Trumpet call of God. A day of harsh judgment, a day of recompense, the day of astonishment, the great and terrible day of the Lord. May 2nd, 2007, from the Lord our God and Saviour, the word of the Lord spoken to Timothy, for all those who have ears to hear. Thus says the Lord, it will surely happen, it shall surely come to pass. They shall glorify my name in the day of slaughter. They shall sing in the face of adversity, when troubles encompass them round about says the Lord, whose judgment stands and shall fill the earth in his fiery anger. Behold, the Lord, the Lord of hosts, shall show the world, and even all in the isles, a new and terrible thing. Even a wonder, an astonishment. I shall build a great city. Lo, it shall be a city filled with singing and blood, crying and elation. Yea, a great city of salvation, a city of harvest. Even all the wild wheat shall be there, a city called martyrdom. To my own glory it shall be built, yet in the Lord's mercy it shall not endure. For the sake of my glory it shall continue only for a very short season. Lo, it shall be cut short for the elect's sake. And all who dwell there shall sing the song of the Lord in that day. And those who dwell there shall live there only for an instant, a twinkling of an eye. And in that very same moment, they shall be gone from the earth and be given robes of white. Even in my own house shall they receive them. They shall bow down, yea, they shall give worship and receive healing. There, my children, even there in my bosom, you shall abide for a short season, and you shall never know death any more. Neither pain, nor crying, nor sorrows of any kind shall you remember any more. Only singing and praise in the presence of your shepherd, your redeemer, shall you know. The Lord of hosts is his name, the Holy One of Israel. Behold, I have spoken it, says the Lord. Lo, it shall be, and it shall not tarry, for it comes quickly. Behold, it is at your doorstep. Therefore repent, my people, and give me glory. Yahushua HaMashiach is the way, the truth and the life. Do not just say you know him, live in him. Yea, abide in him. Feed yourself night and day with his doctrine my doctrine. Listen to those I send. You shall know them by their fruit and by their sword, which I myself have placed in their mouths. Therefore, come out, all you mockers. Step forward, every scoffer. Strike down my messengers, if you are able. Kill my prophets, if you have no fear of God in your hearts. Come against them in your false, righteous anger. Come, says the Lord. Come, and you shall be broken in pieces. You shall be brought very low, abased in my hot anger, then lifted up because of my mercy. And you, O wicked, true concubines of Satan, even you wicked vipers who do shake your fists at heaven and spit at the King, the Holy One, come and hiss at my chosen, the redeemed from among men, the first fruit to my glory in Christ, and you shall be brought down to hell, which is death and the grave. For from the dust had I formed you, you broken vessels of great dishonor, and to the dust shall you return. Thus is the eternal state of my punishment. Thus is the punishment by my own hand, 
Destruction of the wicked in the lake that burns, consumed in an instant, gone from my presence for eternity. Darkness, outer darkness, nothingness is your reward, and you shall never even know you had received it, or received it not. You shall know nothing, nor shall you have any part in life. It is taken from you, and shall never again be granted to you. Your inheritance is lost. This, O oh perverse generation, is the eternal state of my punishment, and the eternal recompense for all my children, who have forsaken me utterly in their willful adoption by Satan, the evil shepherd of the goats made fat, fat for the slaughter. You are consumed, and he who bore you, even he called Lucifer and Satan, that wicked serpent, the dragon, he will receive equal for his evil deeds in the lake called Eternal Torment. It is falsely called so, for the lake of my burning heart is judgment and not life, a consuming fire, and it is reserved for him and his angels, says the Lord. So turn, says the Lord, depart from your wicked ways, run quickly, for the time is at hand. The great and dreadful day of the Lord is here. Yes, it is very near. Be hidden, not left and exposed. Seek sanctuary in your Redeemer, for he is called Christ and Jesus. Yahushua is his name, the resurrection and the life, the gift, the loving mercy of God, which endures forever. Oh, Emmanuel.